and welcome back everyone. I hope you enjoyed the sunny skies we had this morning and this afternoon those clouds increase and we expect cloud cover to stick with us into tonight as a weak disturbance passes by and as you can see it is still pretty overcast on that corning sky cam. So as meteorologists we look at something called the jet stream which refers to fast moving winds in the upper level of the atmosphere. Now whenever the jet stream dips over our region that is indicative of cooler weather and also rainy weather. This week we expect the jet stream to dip southwards over a region. This will usher in cooler and rainy weather for this week. As a result, we are tracking three disturbances. We have this parade of systems which will impact our region. The first one will brush our area tonight with a few showers. The next disturbance is likely to impact our region Sunday night into Monday. And then we are tracking a bigger weather system which is slamming California right now with some showers. Those, that, that, that system will impact our region Tuesday into Thursday. So this is a look at what we are tracking for this week. The first wave of low pressure will push through our region with a few showers later tonight. Now we expect those showers to push out of our area by Sunday morning. So generally expect a dry Easter day, limited sunshine. However, the next disturbance is likely to brush our region again Sunday night into Monday with a few showers and it's done. We are expecting more showers on Tuesday as a bigger weather system nears our region. So this wave of low pressure is likely to impact our area Monday night into Tuesday with rain showers. We expect a rainy day on Tuesday as that low pressure pulls through our area. Now we expect those showers to persist into Wednesday as the low pressure slowly moves to the east. So tonight, rainfall totals will remain on the light side, generally less than a quarter of an inch. Then as we roll through the forecast into Monday, more showers are likely as another wave of low pressure impacts our region. And we are generally expecting about a quarter to about a half an inch of rain. Then the next system is likely to brush our area again on Tuesday into Wednesday with more rain. So this week is definitely looking like a week to keep those rain gear handy. So again, as you can see right now, that wave of low pressure is brushing our area with a few showers. Those showers are particularly impacting the Northern Tier and we expect those showers to linger for much of the evening. However, as you step outside right now, our temperatures are generally ranging from the upper 40s to the lower 50s, about 53 in Elmira, 45 in Ithaca. This evening, showers are possible, again, particularly over the northern tier. We expect our temperatures to gradually fall through the 40s. For Easter Day, limited sunshine with a high near 55 degrees. And this is a look at the next seven days. All right, Deshaun. Thank you, thank you.